Greg and Mrs. Grant on 94.9 Mix FM. Hey, Mo, what's going on with you right now? I just got out of a parking ticket. <laughs> got out of a parking ticket? <laughs> okay, Not a speeding let's... ticket, a parking ticket. Well, let me tell you, okay, first of all, don't judge me. I'm not a terrible person. I'm going to tell you the story. Uh-huh. So I like the qualifier. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's a good qualifier. Okay, so I run a show at Cafe Pate, and I was in a hurry, and I was uh, I backed up into a spot that was not convenient to the location that I was doing my show at um, at all. It was actually really far away. So I finished up the show, and I got back, and I realized it was a handicapped spot. And oh, I was like, ah. boy. How was it marked? Did it have a sign, or was it just painted on the ground? Because if it's just painted on the ground, I, from what I understand, you might not be but, guilty. <laughs> there was a sign, oh. but it was dark, and I felt terrible. I was like, no. I was thinking of, like, the hundreds of people that needed that spot. That's where my mind went, right? Uh-huh. So I panicked, because it really was an accident. So I went to court to fight it, because I was like, why not? Because it really was an accident. So I get to court, and... All these people going up had really legitimate reasons. Like, oh, my placard fell off. Oh, I oh, see. Wait a minute. So you're, you're, you're in, in group. court specifically for handicapped parking <laughs> violations. Yes. Everybody else who's there has also violated this law. A couple, like two or three people. <laughs> yeah, it's a thing. So but are you like shrinking like... down in your seat because you don't feel like you have a legitimate reason at this point? Yes. Okay. <laughs> exactly. I was sitting there like, oh, God, I have to go to the judge and be like, I just didn't see, you know? <laughs> and so uh, my friend Roxy Murari said, take pictures of where it was. So I'm listening to these people's really great, legitimate stories about why they did that. And I get up, they call me up, and I sit down, and he, he says, it's Judge Seaman, and he says, what's, what's, what's your story? And I said, well, I don't really have a a really good reason it was really an accident i honestly did not see the sign <laughs> like i don't have a good backstory but i do have pictures so i brought up my camera and i showed him the pictures and he said it really is dark <laughs> <laughs> oh my wow well, yeah, but, what you don't have lights on your car you know i mean come on well no i mean it was parked in a dark area it really was uh-huh. and uh and I took a really great angle, by the way. I was pretty proud of the camera <laughs> angle. <laughs> Any Photoshop so, involved? No. Okay, good. He, he, and so he, like, looks at me and he goes, I'm going to give you a warning. Aww. I, like, I know. He was so nice. I was like, oh, my gosh, because it was $406. I don't have that kind of 400 <laughs> Yes. Holy cow. I thought a parking ticket would be like, you know, 50 bucks or something like that. Oh, no, no. You don't park at a handicap. You know what I mean? Like, what kind of person does that? I'm not lazy. I don't mind walking. So, of course, I felt terrible. But I'm sure he hear, like he hears a million excuses all the time. I can't know? believe like, he bought yours, truthfully. I, I would have been harder on you than he was. She didn't give an excuse, though. She just said it was, it was dark. an accident. It was dark. <laughs> I'm trying to be an adult, you know, and address these things. <laughs> it's so hard. And not run away, you know? I don't like adulting. <laughs> not fun. Well, yeah, I mean, you know, doing adult things like changing my oil, you know? Yeah. <laughs> Going to court and fighting handicapped parking tickets. That's what adults do. Well, congratulations to you. Yeah, that's you. awesome. You, you got one over on the man. Yeah, man. That's pretty good. I'm doing like air punches to the Rocky theme right now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>